and such me. Such my lips. Anyone receiving comes to North Street. You're not allowed to do that. Yes, we are. You're not allowed to do that. You can't detain me. I can. I've just detained you. Yes, search me. Search me, officer. Search me. I haven't done anything. Search me. Price! Price! Put the machete down! Put the machete down! Put the machete down! Put the machete down! Put the machete down now! Welcome to Audit Oblivion, where we highlight wildest police interactions. You have the right to like, comment, and subscribe. Anything you do can and will help us create more amazing content. Without further ado, let's get into today's video. On the 4th of December 2023, plain-clothed officers from the neighborhood support team were on a routine patrol. They spotted Kevi Kabula acting suspiciously. As they closed in, they saw him stash a package in his trousers. Classic signs of a drug deal. Huh? Right, at the moment yeah. you're detained for a section 23 yeah. mission to drugs act search. Yeah. I believe... You search me. You've just had something in your hand and you were serving up to these people I here. I'm waiting okay? my, That's my friend. I'm, I'm not doing anything. I'm PC1 friend. from Fort Worth Police Station. You're detained for the purpose of a search. So what's I've just the, told what's you the, what's why. What's the reason for the search? For drugs? Yeah. So you're only looking for drugs, right? Yeah. No problem. Any other questions before I continue? No. Okay, you're detained for the search and you're entitled to a copy of the search record. There's my ID. Have you got any other questions before I start? Have you got anything in your pockets or on your person at all that you shouldn't have? No. Because if I don't find anything, what I believe I saw, I'm going to take you back to the police station right. for a strip search. That's not, that's not in the rats though. It is. You're searching for drugs right now. If you yeah. don't find Keep anything on me, still. then you're allowed to let me go legally by the law. You're we just call up the evidence. You're allowed to let me go. If you haven't found anything on me, you're allowed to let me well, go. Well, I suspect you've got something down the front of your trousers. You, you can that's, search that's, me. That's search what, my lips. Anyone receiving comes to North Street. You're not allowed to do yes, that. Yes, we are. You're not allowed yes, to do that. You can't detain me. I can. I've just detained you. Yes, search me. Search me, officer. Search me. I haven't done anything. Search me. You can't. How can you take me to the police station? Because that's what we're going to do the search. Oh. I haven't got anything on me. I haven't yeah, sold I no you, drug. I saw you put Check, e your check everything. Right, you're check just going to need to stay still. Otherwise, you haven't wait. searched listen, me yet. Listen, listen. I know. Said you're searching me. Can okay, you but you need to just calm down and stand still. I'm trying to, but because you're being a bit aggy, I'm going to stop until you've just chilled out a little bit. Okay. All right? I'm literally waiting for a friend who was about to buy some weed. That's why I have a grinder. That's it. Hold on. You've already searched. No, no, we haven't. I've not even I've not even started. I've just found this in your pocket. I'm just gonna have a quick look at it. What have you found in my pocket? We'll we'll find what you put down there, don't worry. Search me, officer. We're gonna take nothing on you. We're gonna take to the police station and we'll search you there in a controlled area. For what? Drugs. I haven't done anything, right. officer. You've already searched me. There's yeah, nothing on me. Okay. We'll get there to the police station. We'll right. sort it out there. Cool. You haven't finished searching. Well, at the moment, you're under arrest on suspicion of possession of a Class A drug. What okay, so you don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defence. Do not mention in no question eight, something which will outline in court. You haven't anything found you do no say eight, may be given in evidence. But you haven't found no the reason for eight, the arrest is for the prompt and effective investigation of the offence no to allow for further searches. Okay, I've just found that in your pocket, which I believe to be Class A but drugs. You found no class a. What in my pocket? What, have what you I just found pulled out pocket? your pocket, which is all on you camera. Pulled any, you pulled out Rizla, you pulled out a grinder and chew it. That's it. A grinder and, and chew it. that. You did not pull that out of my pocket. That came out of this. That came out of your right pocket. Okay. Just hold that. I literally watched you pick it up off the floor. I literally watched you pick okay. it up off the floor. You just got one pair of trackies on. Yeah. What I'm saying. I have no drugs on me. Well, I just pulled out something from this pocket, which I believe to be drugs. How? You just searched this pocket. You literally right. just searched this pocket. Mate, stop You're messing around. This okay, this isn't day you one for me. You picked off okay? the floor. I can't see you your eyes. You picked something off, off the like, floor. Yeah, I dropped it on the floor, which I pulled out of your pocket. How? You just searched this pocket. What pocket Stand did you pull still. it out of? What pocket did you pull it out of? What pocket did you pull it out of? I'm gonna, what pocket did you put I'm going to put that on the floor, right? It's what open. Pocket? That, that right tracksuit bottom just pocket. You searched it and there's nothing chill in there, bro. Chill out. You just searched it and there's nothing in there, bro. Right, these three yeah, phones just come out of your left jacket pocket. Yeah. That's not illegal. <sighs> George. Right, this cash has just come out of your inside yeah, zip pocket. Still haven't broken the law. 
Sorry, we're broken the lock. I can't open that, like this shit's illegal, bro. What's illegal is what I've seen in that plastic wrapper, what? What? which is either wrapper. Daniel Pants or in what your other pocket. Wrapper? So points. first you said it's in this pocket, now you're saying it's down my pants. Now you're saying, you're not making sense of I am making you're sense. Not making sense of the Let me just be clear. I'll be honest I've with searched you, you and I found that wrap in How? that pocket. How? I just watched you When I pulled up, you put something in this pocket and then we're messing around with your waistband. What waistband? Okay? Messing around with waistband? So that's what, what I'm trying search, to find. Mean? Which is why search, I'm mean? taking your back. A quick search revealed a wrap of crack cocaine, 412 pounds in cash, and three mobile phones. But the real shocker came later. In custody. Officers found 127 wraps of crack cocaine and 60 wraps of heroin worth nearly 1,870 pounds stuffed in his underpants. Kabbalah's phones told a damning story. Messages and travel logs showed regular trips between London and Peterborough, proving he ran a lucrative drug line across the cities. Kabbalah was sentenced to four years behind bars. On January 27, 2022, police executed a warrant in connection with the kidnap and robbery of two construction workers. This raid led them to Christopher Griffiths, a 46-year-old man from Peterborough, whose criminal activities extended far beyond the initial investigation. Put the machete down! 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 Put I don't know who's at my door. Plus, I don't know who's at my door. I've got my kids here. Can you f got that here? Yeah? Okay. Mr. Griffiths. Yes, mate. Okay. I'm DC2357 Trevor. I work at Cambridgeshire Police. At this point, I'm arresting you on conspiracy to commit robbery. Robbery? Yep. From where? Kidnap and false imprisonment. Kidnap and false imprisonment? Okay. Mate, I've just come back in. I've just come. And, I've just scored and come back in. I ain't been anywhere. The time is now 7:30 hours. Okay, you do not have to say anything, but I'm harm your defence if you don't mention when questioned something about in court. Anything you do say, we're giving evidence. Do you understand? Kidnapping, robbery. I've just come. And, I've just some. It is I've in just... relation to a robbery that is believed to have occurred on or around the 1st of July of this year, where some businessmen had 77,000 pounds stolen from them. To do with me. Yes. I don't know, but I haven't, but mate, I don't know, but I don't know anything about that, mate. In Griffiths's home in Orton Gold Hay, officers discovered a kitchen turned into a drug den. 2,410 pounds worth of heroin and crack cocaine were hidden throughout the kitchen, including in the freezer. A constantly ringing burner phone suggested active drug dealing. When officers arrived, Griffiths even confronted them with a machete. A few months ago. So the warrant was, was here? The warrant, I've got a copy of the warrant. Okay, okay. a warrant has been sworn out by a judge for us to attend this address, okay? okay? This is your copy. I'll sit down and go through it with you in a moment. Okay. We just got a problem is Chris has come to the front door with a machete. I can half understand why with us forcing okay. so entry to the door. No, we've, I've right? arrested him for something else. Okay. Right. Okay. 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 And, um, I'll go over that bit. Yeah, sorry. I know it's sort of the adrenaline's going at the moment. I apologise for that, all right? And, um, but we've just got to just... Why you not? Why did you have to break my phone? You're not <laughs> There are reasons okay. for it. I just can't... I'll go through it all with you in a moment, OK? okay. Um, we've got Griffiths, but he came to the door with a machete, so it's all been a bit manic here. Christopher Griffiths was initially sentenced to 10 years in prison for conspiracy to commit robbery, two counts of kidnap and fraud after being found guilty of additional charges related to the supply of Class A drugs. His sentence was extended by an additional two years and three months. Thank you for watching Audit Oblivion. If you found this video informative, leave us a like, and if you are new here, give us a follow.